टोटल रिलेशन ही इन एरिया सी सिलेंडर अबाउट बेसिक एंड ट्रिकी टाइप्स जस्ट वी सी हियर दिस इज द सॉलिड सिलेंडर सो वी आर स्टार्टिंग विद बेसिक पॉइंट ऑफ द सॉलिड सिलेंडर व्हाट इज द बेसिक पॉइंट सो दिस इज सॉलिड सिलेंडर This is a solid cylinder. Okay, so this is O point. Suppose this is A point, and this is B point. This is C point. So this is radius R, and this is height of the cylinder. So what is the important and basic formula of the cylinder? First one is base area. base area of cylinder is what that is pi r square okay so base area of cylinder is pi r square then second point is what that is curved surface area curved surface area of solid cylinder is what 2 pi r h okay where r is the radius of the cylinder and h is the height of cylinder in the same way this is total सरफेस एरिया सो टोटल सरफेस एरिया ऑफ सिलेंडर इज व्हाट 2 पाई आर एच प्लस 2 पाई आर एस सो हियर 2 पाई आर एंड 2 पाई आर एस फॉर्म सो दिस इज 2 पाई आर इनटू एच प्लस आर सो विद द हेल्प ऑफ दिस थ्री बेसिक फार्मूला वी विल सॉल्व ऑल द क्वेश्चन so base formula is for base area of cylinder is what pi r square and curved surface area of cylinder is what that is 2 pi r h and the total surface area of cylinder is what 2 pi r h plus 2 pi r square so 2 pi r is common here so 2 pi r into h plus r this is the right form now see the first question first question is find the volume of curved surface area find the volume find the volume and uh, curved surface area and total surface area of the cylinder with diameter of base 14 cm and height 80 cm so first to see what is given diameter of base so you know r radius equal to what diameter by 2 So if diameter is given 14 centimeter, then radius will be 14 by 2, that is 7. So radius will be 7 centimeter. And height of cylinder is also given 80. So this is how much? 80 centimeter. Okay. So we have to find first volume. So you know volume of cylinder is what? Pi r square h. So value of pi is 22 by 7. And radius is seven, so seven into seven, and height is given eighty. So this is how much eighty. So this is seven seven cancel out. So you will get seven to the or seven to the fourteen and seven to the fourteen and one five four into eighty. So this is how much eight four the thirty two carry three eight five the forty and three forty three. Eight one zero eight four two so one two three two one two three two centimeter cube because it is the volume so this is right answer one two three two centimeter cube is correct answer. Now we have to find curved surface area that is CSA. So curved surface area of the cylinder you know this is two pi r h. So two multiply pi is given twenty two by seven. R is also given seven and H is given eighteen. So this cancel out. So your answer will be forty four multiply eighteen. So this is eight four the thirty two and eight four the thirty two three thirty five three five two zero. This is the surface area. So this is centimeter square. Now we have to find total surface area of the cylinder. So total surface area of cylinder will be what? See. So this is total surface area of cylinder. You know the formula two pi r into 
R plus H. So this is 2 into 22 by 7 into 7. Into R is given 7 plus H is given 80. So this is how much this 7 can see now. So 44 into 87, this is 80. Height is given 80. So 80 plus 7 is what? 87. So 44 into 87 centimeters square is the right answer. So for this type of question, there is a volume, curved surface area and total surface area. And given diameter and height. So first you find radius. So radius is d by 2, that is 7 cm, height is 80 cm, so total surface area will be 2 by r into r plus h. So 2 into 22 by 7, 7 cancel 44 into 87 cm square is the right answer. Now you see the second type of question. So this is the type number second. How many iron rods? Each length 14 cm and diameter 4 cm can be made out of 0.88 meter cube of the iron. For this type of question, what is the basic? For this type of question, if any time this type of question asks okay, how many rows, then you find the volume of the greater divided by volume of smaller. So here number of number of iron rods. So number of iron rods equal to what? Made out of the iron. That is made out of 0.88 meter cube of iron. So volume of iron is already given 0.88. This is meter cube. So change this meter cube into centimeter. So this is 100 into 100 into 100. Okay. So now volume of iron rod. So iron rod each length of this and that. So we have to find volume of cylinder pi r square. So pi is what? 22 by 7. Radius is what? Diameter is given 4 cm. So radius will be 2 half of diameter and height is given 14. So this is height is given 14. So this is height. So, volume of iron rod will be pi r square h. So, pi 22 by 7, radius is given diameter 4, so radius will be 2, so this is 2 s square. Into h, h is also given how much? That is 14. So, this is multiplied by 14. So, we can solve this question by 0 0.88 multiply 100 into 100 into 100 okay and this 7 comes to upper so this is 7 here this is 22 into 4 into 40 when we remove this 0 point then we will get here 100 so this 100 will cancel this and here 7 to the 40 okay and here 2 4 the 8 2 4 the so this 42 again here 4 11 okay and here what 11 to 4 to 4 uh, you check here this is the 2 so 2 4 that 44 11 4 11 so 11 to 11 to the 20 so this is 2 5 so 10 so how many number 50 into 100 so our answer is 50 into 100 that is 5000 this is the correct answer so for this type of question how many iron rods each length 14 centimeter in diameter can be made out of 0.88 meter cube of iron. For this type of question, number of iron was equal to given volume, volume of iron that is 0.88. This is meter cube. So change this meter cube into centimeter. So 100, 100, 100. Now volume of iron ore, volume of one iron ore. So I am going volume pi r square pi is given 22 by 7 radius that is the half of diameter 2 so 2 is square and height that is height is given 40. So this is again 0 0.88 100 100 100 and then this 7 comes to numerator that is 7. So 22 into 4 into 40 and when this remove the decimal you will get 100. So this 100 cancel out. Cancel this number, you will get 15 to 100, 5000. This is the right answer.
Now type number three question. This type number three question is what? If the lateral surface area of cylinder is 94.2 cm square and its height is 5 cm, then find the radius of the base. For this type of question, you know lateral surface area and the curved surface area of cylinder are same. So, formula of curved surface area is what? That is 2 pi r h. So, 2 pi r h equal to what? 94.2. So this is 2 multiply, uh, this is 2 multiply 22 by 7 into, that is R is given how much R is more, we have to find. So this is R and H is given 5. So this is 5. So this is 94.2. Now you see, we have to find radius. So radius equal to what? 94.2 multiply 7 and divided by 2 into 22 multiply 5. Now this is a decimal. So just remove the decimal and put here 10. So this decimal remove. Now this is 2 4 ja 8, 2 7 ja 14 and 2 1 ja 2. Okay, now no any common factor, so multiply this. So 7 1 ja 7, 7 7 ja 49 carry 4. 7, 4, 28 and 4, 3, 2. And here, 5, 2, 10, 1, 10. So this is 1, 10 into 100, that is 1100. Okay? So now, 3, 2, 9, 7. So divide this 3, 2, 9, 7 by 11. Okay? So 11, 2, 22. So this is 22. 10. Now, 109, 11, 9, 99. So this is 99. 0 and 1. Now this is 7. So 100, 7. So this is again 11, 9, 99. So this is 99. 70 minus 9, that is 8. Again this is a point, 80, 11, 7. Now already we have 2, 0. So this decimal comes here. So this is 2.9. So we can write it 3. So our correct answer is 3 centimeters. So for this type of question, first you see what is given. Lateral surface area given, then 2 pi r h equal to 94.2. 2 is 2, pi is given, then r is not given, h is given. And you can find in this way r. So in this way we have solved all the questions of the type number 3. Number 4 question is for C. A rod of 2 cm diameter and 30 cm length is converted into a wire of 3 meter length of a uniform thickness. Then diameter of the wire. For this type of question, what we do? For this type of question, just to feel volume of the smaller equal to volume of the larger. So here rod of 2 cm diameter and 30 cm length is converted into a wire of 3 meters. So, volume of this rod equal to volume of the this wire. So, you know volume of rod divided by pi r square h. So, pi r square that is pi into r1 s square h1 equal to pi into r2 s square h2. Okay. So, pi and pi cancel out. Here R1 is what 2 cm diameter, so radius will be half of diameter that is 1. So this is 1 S square into H. H is given 30 cm. Here R2. So R2 is not given, so we will write simply R2 S square. Now H2 is given meter. So we have to change this meter into centimeter. So you know 1 meter is 100 centimeter. So this 3 meter equal to how much? 300 centimeter. So this is 30 equal to R2 S square into 300. So you can cancel out this number or you can 30 by 30 and here 30 by 30 10. So to 10 into R2 S square equal to 1. So R2 S square equal to 1 by 10. So R2 equal to what? Root under 1 by 10. So we can write root 1 is 1. So this is 1 by root 10. So we have to find diameter. 
so diameter equal to what diameter equal to 2 into radius right so this 2 into radius is given 1 by root 10 so our correct answer is 2 upon root 10 so in option 2 by root 10 centimeter is b so our correct answer is b so for this type of question simple technique volume of one equal to volume of other so for here cylinder that is why treated as cylinder so volume of first equal to volume of second so volume for the volume pi r square h so this is pi r1 square into h1 pi r2 square h2 this pi this pi cancel out so here radius r1 that is diameter is given 2 cm so radius is half of diameter so 2 by 2 1 so 1 square into h1 is given 30 so this is 30 here r2 is square so here r2 is not given we have to find so this is r2 x square into h2 is given meter that is 3 meter so this is centimeter so 3 into 100 so now this is the 1 into 30 and r2 square 300 so 30 was just 30 so this is 10 10 into r2 square equal to 1 so r2 square 1 by 10 and r2 equal to what root under 1 by 10 1 by root 10 so d equal to twice of diameter divided 2 by root 10 in this way you can solve all this question best of you.